The Sword in the Stone, written by Grace Macaron and illustrated by Joe Bodie. Long ago, there was a land without a king. I will be king, said the tall, fat man. I will be king, said the short, thin man. I will be king, said the tall, thin man. I will be king, said the short, fat man. And so there was a war. Old men fought, young men fought. The young boys hid in the bushes and watched. Among them was Arthur. The war must end, said the people. They went to Merlin, who knew many things. Some said he even knew magic. We need a king, said the people. Merlin smiled and waved his arms. A great sword in a great stone grew out of the earth. He who pulls the sword out of the stone will be king, Merlin said. I can, said the tall fat man. He pulled and pulled and pulled and pulled. But the tall fat man could not pull the sword from the stone. I can said the short, thin man. He pulled and pulled and pulled and pulled. But the short, thin man could not pull the sword from the stone. I can, I can, said the tall, thin man and the short, fat man. But they could not pull the sword from the stone. All kinds of people tried. No one could pull the sword from the stone. So the war went on. Old men still fought. Young men still fought. The young boys still hid in the bushes and watched. Arthur was still among them. One day, Arthur met an old man who had lost his sword. Arthur helped him look for it. Arthur searched and searched. Soon he came upon the great sword in the great stone. Arthur pulled the sword. Out it came. The old man shouted, Long live the king! Long live King Arthur! Arthur was surprised. The people were surprised. The tall, fat man, the short, thin man, the tall, thin man, and the short, fat man were surprised. Only the old man was not surprised. The old man was Merlin. He knew all along that Arthur would be king. Now the war was over. The people got their king. Arthur was just a boy but he was the best king ever.